So good morning. It's always amazing when I find out that people really just don't understand that this is 2022. And in America, you know, in America, we all have something to do with public services. We all have something to do with how our families are provided services as we can understand we all have something to do in America. In America, you were just chosen to do by your willingness to go through what they call trials and tribulations. And what are trials and tribulations? Well, you know, the real deal is that the universe sends something your way and you may not even know why you're going through whatever you're going through. You're just going through whatever you're going through. And the real deal is that, um, anyways, when you realize that people are operating in their own little window, meaning that they're not following any of the regulatory guidance as an American citizen, the obligation to perhaps follow regula regula regulations, you know, when you receive federal money and as an American citizen, you need to understand there's an obligation for the use of the money. And that's just real. And I can tell you that the obligation for the use of the funds is a reality. Everybody understands what it means when there is regulatory guidance or when you're not compliant. Nevada, however, they were on the Republican side. What does that mean? Black people used to be Republicans and there are still black people that are Republicans. But in the South, it means that they are in total control. And did you know that there were still plantations operating where people would take it from the people and the children and there are no criminal charges being pressed down there? I'm sorry, this is America. But there are backwoods that are not participating in the everyday understanding of just who you are. People here because this was a red state and the we the people state and perhaps you're not counted as part of we the people. But we're not providing services to all of the children and using the children as revenue. And see, I knew in Sacramento they were always using the children with special needs as revenue. And that's just real. Because the children in poverty are, are counted for the federal dollars. The children who are, I said poverty, qualify for free and reduced lunch. I mean, middle, low, middle to low income, children who are bilingual, children who are special ed. And uh, there was a little bit of money for gifted and talented, but nothing like the money for neglected and delinquent. But when that money comes to the state, the state has an obligation to follow the regulations and allocate the dollars down to the local school sites. That's what local control came in. Local control came in when Clark County became a local district, not the state operating, but the local people. Well, the local people have just kept all people from the table and they have done whatever they wanted to do. I don't know what the harbor is. I don't think I understand the harbor. I don't know if it's the 14 people in the houses and I don't understand how many, how women who are not like me, have 14 to 16 little black children and they have adopted, adopted them. And now they get money from the state and the federal government. I'm sorry. Not when the kinship money was being restricted from the families who were trying to support their grandchildren. But when you see how they live in the South, uh, black people, my people, wake up. That's what I got to say. You got to wake up because this is 2022. And it's not about what you're willing to do. It is about stepping up. It's about waking up. And when people that you don't know, that you just don't know, would restrict your podcast or restrict your ability to share your concerns and limit your ability for people to find your Facebook page, well, they didn't just lost their ever-loving mind. Because they thought that they were gods. And see, the God mentality about a person who is not known to another person, but they can do something is criminal. That's what I'll say. And criminal mischief is what we seem to be doing. What people don't really understand is that criminal mischief can be documented and collected 
and then people can be held accountable. Are you not paying attention to what Mayor Garland said? He said it is time to just prosecute. We don't need any more rules on the book. We have enough rules on the books. So understand we have enough rules on the books to demonstrate how the money comes in because the money comes in not because the people put it in, boo. Maybe they do. But they don't put it in for all children. They make sure they have enough for the burden of the state, which would be teaching the children with disabilities, teaching the children in poverty, teaching the children who have language necessities. Just, you know what I'm saying? But no, you don't know what I'm saying because you don't obviously understand. The federal money is just not for the gifted and talented only. And it's not for the regular, it's not for every child. So, as we're all Americans, we all know that we've all been paying. That means we're all entitled. What am I telling you? We're entitled to the benefit of citizenship. But if you've been in the public school system for 12 years and you've never voted, if you've been in the public school system for 12 years and you have children and you got a certificate of completion, what did it do for you, boo? Not a goddamn thing. There are women around here. I seen a woman at the grocery store here, Smith's, and she had nine children, a tenth one in the belly, in the belly. And I asked her, well, did you get the American Rescue money? She said, no, I never worked because I'm special ed. Okay, I'm special ed too, and I got it. It's not about your ability. It's about being an American, and every American should have gotten that money to help uplift them through this turbulent time. But through this turbulence time, not many people got that money. And when the homeless people are getting evicted now, but the, the state got that millions of dollars to protect people through this crisis. And the people who had knowledge took advantage of the program, but the people who could not read who the state had failed initially did not participate in the program and perhaps or more people are getting homeless. You see, the obligation of the state to pay, just create a pathway for you is a real thing. But it is about fools following fools. And I don't follow foolish people. Nope, you better have some real knowledge that I can grasp. Because if you ain't got nothing to say, I don't have no time for you. And that's just my reality in America. The word is e purpose, you know, many there's one. But out of one, there will be none. And who will you be in 2022? What are you willing to do? Well, y'all have a nice day. I'm going to go ahead and get off. Because, you know, not many people are awake. And it really doesn't matter. Because life is all about what you're willing to do. So, the word is. Yep. That's what it is. Oh, my goodness. For to have people to try to correct you about how the federal money comes to the state and, and, and the invitation for everyone to participate into the $770 million. You see, in America, you're only free as you want to be. And if you don't understand freedom and you've never stepped your game up and gotten involved in the communities in which you live. Because, you know, in the military, they're usually told that they cannot influence or engage in the public arena because they're military. But now, retirees, it's time to step up. There are many, many black people with lots of knowledge. And we need all of it to ensure that access happens for the Youngest and the neediest. I've seen so many African-American children who were not enrolled in early Head Start. But by the age of seven, they are being assessed. And then by the age of seven, by the age of 11, they can be removed from their gifted and talented places, placements, according to Nevada legislatures. And you see, it's the legislators that are determining how the dollars are used, but they're not even following the federal reg regulations. And that's what, the, the hey, the money is just kind of caught up right now. And I do mean it's caught up, meaning that they're... All right, well, enough is enough. I'm pretty pissed off this morning, so I probably should just take a break. Because when they would limit your podcast or mute your voice...
as you are talking. And is it a joke? No, it's not a joke. But know when people are messing with you, huh, that you just become a bigger rebel. So the word is, in America, e purpose, you know, out of many, there's one. But out of one, who will you be in 2022? What are you willing to do? Stand up.